And we're back, I think. Yeah, we're back. And it's me, Tony, and me, Gage, and me, Kelsey, and then Jed's here as well. That's You're really... all of us? I'm all of you <laughs> and for Jed. none of you. Except... Right. It's not so we're in this locker, we're pooping our pants, and muscle muscle head rip man maybe <laughs> near us. Buff sub zero. My dude's gotta be hungry. I'm just sitting here eating pizza. Maybe he's got some pizza. Ah. That he, that he took with him through the sewers. I heard asylum pizza was delish. Oh yeah. Or he just took some of that burning flesh in the sink. Delicious. Pre-cooked. Just pretend it's like pizza. Fell off pizza. God damn it. God damn it. Fuck it. So... Oh, ho, oh, ho, 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 ho. I don't know, Gage. Where the fuck are you? Oh, there we go. Just slowly take your time, dipshit. He'll never get. Does anyone know where we're going? No. Where's Gage? Well, He's the you one have to knows. go back to where you were before. Yeah, what did you Actually, find? I think it's right here. What did you find? A key or something? I only found no, no, one he... valve. You need two valves. Oh. One's right in front of me, though. So. I thought it said the number two valve. I thought it was two oh. valves. I don't know. Maybe. Look in your objectives thingy. Do I have objectives? Oh. Yeah. Turn on the sprinkler system. You missed what did it say? It just says turn on the sprinkler system. It said something after that. Oh, and the yeah, two valves. So you got one. I have no idea where the other one is though. It's gonna be across the room, them. right. Oh fuck. He's like right there. Did you? Yup. Go in the locker. Nope. Oh. Mama. This yeah, this is just back where you're coming from. Really scared of anus. I am. They are scary. <laughs> Is he in there? Ripping one's face off does seem <laughs> rather fun. What if God was one of us? Just a strange thing of us. I don't no, think we've been in family. here, have we? Yeah. This looks new to me. Sucking dick like one of us. Don't stroke your bottle <laughs> while you sing that. Yeah, this, <laughs> is, this is new. Why not? Listen, guys, I don't promote blasphemy in my channel. Yes, sir. Yes, you do. We love Jed, all gods here. Jed, you're a gay and didn't you know God hates the gays. That's fine. Well, I guess you're a bi. That's right, I am. It's not the same thing. In God's eyes, it is. You like dicks either way, yes? <laughs> Did you ever notice how everything that's supposed to be a sin is like the funnest shit? <laughs> I haven't noticed that shrimp is an eating shrimp is an abomination. It's like on the same level. Okay, as that might be the only thing I agree with because I think shrimp are gross. Shrimp are fucking delicious. They're like little fetuses. They're like, like little pink flesh. delicious little cockroaches of the sea. I feel like someone. What? I feel like someone like me or a group of people like me got together and they said, "Listen, 
what is all the stuff we want to keep to ourselves that we can <laughs> tell people that the they cool shouldn't people. have? The cool people club. Right. <clears throat> So what happens if you die? Is it just checkpoints? I'm yeah, assuming. I just need somebody to a checkpoint. And yet, for some reason, it's still super scary. Right. Oh, hello. Hi, Dad! Oh, he wants your anus. You'll never know! He's like already in the room! <laughs> He's already in the room. If you like pop out in front of them real quick like that, you can actually get away. Nice. But if you let them like grab the door... You don't even know where we're going! Yeah, I do. I actually do. Oh man, he's like right behind you. Oh, you did do that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so now you just have to do it. Nice. Smooth. Smooth, fast acting, to acting. Boom! Ah. 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 Alright. It's a really hot pepper. Strange interlude. <laughs> That's a thing, internet. You've seen it. That's right. Write to it about your friends. Email your dad a clip of it. <laughs> that you that, that you that you cropped Happy and uploaded to Father's Vimeo. Day. Happy Sons Why Day. Why don't you love me, Dad? Here's a video of a guy licking a pepper. <laughs> <laughs> Erotically. 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 <clears throat> I mean, I could be licking something. Says, I don't know different. what was wrong with me, son. We should get together sometime and patch up our Why did I close his door? It's really annoying. <clears throat> Flame off. <laughs> yeah, it also makes it so my visibility is poop. And I also Ooh. have no idea where I'm going. I don't either. I would say look for the room on fire, but it's not on fire. Either. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not on fire. You know, don't you have to go back to the thing you squeezed through? I did squeeze through. No, no, no. Yeah, it's the other way now, isn't it? This way? No, no, no. Not, not the way where you squeeze through. I, th I thought it's that way, isn't it? Or am I wrong? I no, because... Yeah, but two here, right here. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then we're gonna go ahead and assume that it is the exit. But before that, is there a way over there? Because. What are you doing? I don't know, I was just seeing if there's anything over there. Any documents about burgers? Can you close those? Shut that door. Just in case. Right. Well, that didn't help much. Shut the other door. There. Turns out now I'm fucked. Now they have to open the door. Joke's on. <gasps> nice teeth, dude. <laughs> You're so mean. Okay. Turn around and see if the door is. It's still shut. Where did you get one? Ah, uh, who cares? <laughs> Is that a finger salad? You know, sometimes you just get hungry for a finger salad. That's cool. Finger foods. <laughs> ah, die. Hey, here's finger something Gage has never been in. <laughs> here's something Gage has never been in. in the closet. <laughs> Well, Tony just turned into a <laughs> demon. <laughs> Live on video. Morin. They make everything. Yeah. <clears throat> Cell phones. Oh, I've seen this trick before. What? What's in those cupboards? Oh, yes, I can't get in that one. I think that's freezers. That's freezer. Oh, that's a big ass freezer. Duh, haven't you ever seen The Shining? That wasn't even like a walk-in freezer like in The Shining. That was like just like a Dude, big there it is. Freezer. Where'd Gage go? Is he like deucing? Mm -hmm. Dead. That's an elevator shaft. 
Jump on them down. Yeah, we're supposed to go outside. You think this is gonna let us walk outside? Probably not. Hey, you missed that. This is one of the actual games where like I have enjoyed reading the documents. Otherwise, you're not gonna get a lot of story, anyways. Subject: Special Research Bluebird. General problem: For the past several months, Bluebird has been endeavoring to ascertain by research, study, and instruction in some practice what value, if any, can be derived from sleep induction and hypnotic techniques when applied to war and specific agency problems. Can we create post H, which is hypnotic control, an action contrary to an individual's basic moral principles? Can we guarantee total amnesia under any on all conditions? Can we alter a person's personality? How long will it hold? And what are full details on a sleep inducing machine? So, again, there's some hints that I may just be crazy. But you are, and then someone just gave you a camcorder. Right, and then they're like, by the way, you're also... Well, they give you a Wait, battery. Wait, there's a folder this. on the ground back there, wasn't there? No, that's called a monitor. Oh, it was just... It was glowing, and it was flat. I thought it was... A it's K. Uh -huh. Oh, somebody burst the doors off. That's good. That's good news. Totally not that good. Nice. No. Like it's dark as shit out here. Yeah, even the infrared's not helping. I don't like this very much. Just get to your fucking car. Screw right. father, what's his face? I went back in. What? 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 I don't know. Eventually, if you throw enough hand grenades, you're gonna hit your target. <laughs> I don't even know your name, but I've come to think of you as more of my blood, my Paul. I hope you don't mind, and I hope you don't indulge the vanity of self pity, the fear that your suffering is more than others. We all must endure this, and you are nearly done. There's no way to heaven but by the cross. And every man needs another to help drive the nails in. I am here for you, I am waiting ahead. So, right, I'm gonna literally get nailed to the cross, I think. And then this game will come full circle to be the greatest horror game of all time. Somehow I don't want to go in the woods. Okay, he's almost done. Oh, you can just see jack shit in front of you without your battery. Oh! Uh, what? What? Okay. Well, let's get the fuck out of here! And this is your last battery. Oh, don't worry, it's a creepy glowy barn thing. The old work shed, the old standby. Oh, thank God, I'm one. And another one. And a key. Maintenance shed. Isn't that the shed we went the first time? Yeah, I think across the way. Which one is it? This one? I think so. Because that required a key. Maybe get some shears or something to cut those, uh, the chain around the fence? I don't know. No, I've seen chains around the fence. I doubt we go that way at all. Oh, that's like physically blocking my way. These ghosts can hold you and hurt you, really. 
Oh, the roof, the next logical option. <laughs> Then I get hit by lightning credits. Perfect. <laughs> what a twist! I'm gonna say, please, I can't see. I wish that ghost could just fly you around. It could be your little ghost. Casper! Ghost Rider, the hit series that nobody remembers from the 90s. I remember it. He'd write you little messages like, I love Ghost you. Writer. I thought you said Ghost Rider. Yeah. Writer. The Nick Cage classic. <laughs> oh, the worst movie. <laughs> I was at my friend's and she owned it on the and I was like, why? Did you smack her in the mouth and say, who like, owns DVD, poor person? She was like, I liked the first one, I just didn't like the second one. And you called her a stupid hoe right there. I said, I think it was dumb. The whole thing was. But you can't get in there. Bet it's locked. Have you watched Vampire's Kiss yet? No, I need to. There's actually a new Nick Cage movie out. Yeah. John Cusack and I forget who the other flashlight. And the priest ready to murder you. Hey, buddy. To murder rape you. So we're outside and have to get out. Oh, what were you doing? Shit. So we're outside. The priest left us a message, basically saying that he was gonna nail us to the cross. That's the only way out. So the priest is we like scaled evil? some ceiling, ceilings. There's ghosty things. There's ghosts. Yeah, There's like ghosty things that fly towards you and they're weird. I just smell delicious. Where are all these batteries coming from? Right, that's the problem with this. There's just batteries laying everywhere. Guess how many batteries I've seen in the last year? Like, none. none. <laughs> I would argue that it's in the past where batteries were huge and everybody had them for everything, but it's an HD camera, so... Yeah. Um... He's just taking a piss in the corner. Why you gotta look at him? Listen, if you haven't peed on a dumpster, then you don't know Well, I don't know if he was peeing. I think his arms were in a jacket. Well, I don't... Well, maybe uh, he's peeing anyways. Listen, if you haven't humped a trash can, you don't know what you're missing out. Trash humpers? Yeah. Did you ever watch that? Oh, sure. oh, I'm supposed to go. Oh. Um, I didn't watch it, but I know of it. You should watch we it. Watched, Isn't that where you came from? We watched another, a part of another one of that guy's films in one of my art classes. Okay. What movie? I don't remember what. Gummo. Uh. Spring Breakers. Spring Breakers, so good. No, not Spring Breakers. That's my favorite. This, movie. this is where we came. from. Yeah, you need to go up the stairs and then you come back. Where do you go from there? Because that's where the guy's pissing on the dumpster. I think you. Can you climb up the dumpster? Is there anything up there? Yeah. Go back. What's on the left? Yeah, what's that one? I don't think you have an Dude, I fucking hate this. Like, legit, I hate walking through. Like, right. Oh god. The surround sound in this game. That giant guy found his way out, too, and he's never here at all. Oh, that giant guy's, like, made it outside? Probably. He's Probably. been everywhere else. I haven't else. seen him yet, but I bet he has. We're going up because we can. 
See if I've, I've been here and just didn't, it wasn't down there. You have been up there? I was up there. Is that the ledge you were on before? I think. Maybe. No, I don't think you've ever been in this area before. I haven't been in this area, Not I was above it. it. But yeah, the we'll walk around. Yeah, because that's the guy who was saying. I just go up on that leg. You <laughs> trip and fall on the barbed wire. Credits. And Best game ever. Yeah, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it just looked the same. Say goodbye. It'd be rude to just leave. Maybe he wants to help me though. Oh my god, that's a fountain of blood. Oh, that makes me rock solid. God damn it, Tom. <laughs> if only there were like some birds bathing in it. <laughs> <laughs> Like there's broken digital cameras everywhere what now. Serendipitous terminal beds. Because in this world, nobody uses rechargeables. Especially not a dude with a camera that's HD, but still one of the old timey kind. HD, but it still uses double A's. There we go. Of course it is. Maybe we'll get to see some deformed titties! One could only hope. I mean, if you got them, smoke them, am I right? You know when you whisper oh. to someone, you're supposed to cover the opposite side of your mouth? <laughs> you saw the wall rider, didn't you? You're beginning to understand, but not yet. Even Abraham had to cast his eyes to the ground. But soon, soon, this way! Revelation is at hand! Thanks. When did you see the mall rider? What is that? Is that the big Must guy? Must be the it's floaty be, guy. It's There's like a floaty, thing. ghosty looking thing. He just looks at you and is spooky. And <laughs> spooky. He's super spooky. You're not a woman. 
You're not a woman. Damn it, this you is know? a women ward. Did you ask him his gender? Why are you saying him? You don't know. You don't know. Maybe, don't know. maybe it's just, it's a I don't, I don't even know what a man looks like. <laughs> so. Apparently we don't in this society. <laughs> Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Damned if you do do because pooping is a sin. Poop is <laughs> a sin, keep that shit in your ass. That's the quote from the Bible. Poop is a sin, do not let it pass. Right. Uh, Here's John. How the fuck do they like get, keep getting in? Well, I, I would Maybe assume. There's like a billion of them. Step one, put your dick in the box. Step two, make a open box. And that's the way to do it. I like that you have like a real time encounter in the left. For how long have you been recording? Oh. The hell is the point of coming in here? Maybe you're gonna. Not everything has to have a point, they're just world building. By putting a closet in. <laughs> <laughs> By throwing yeah. closets in the real world, Jet. The immersion. Emotion, 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 emotion. Yeah. Um, nope. Um. Ah! I love you. Okay. I'm going up because he was up, right? I might, not, I might be missing two fingers, but I don't give a I shit. I still grab a How do you not drop your camcorder when you do that? You're always still holding it. Okay. Haven't you ever seen a hand strap? You don't need fingers for that. He has, you know how they make no. tough books? He has one of those, but like a camcorder. But a camcorder. Jed, I mean because it, how does he not drop it when he jumps like that? Because he's also and spider catches the ledge. Like, it seems like he would crush it. So it's listen, like, uh, we're gonna end up on top of the woman's floor, and there's gonna be like a cross or something. You're gonna and end up on top of the woman's floor. This, you, this game cannot, have cannot a have a positive ending. No. It's too horrible to live with. You have to die. <laughs> you're right, I think you're gonna be on top of the ward with a cross, and then he's just gonna bend you over and have sex with you. That'll be the end. What did that say? Three pieces. Because there's a key there. Yay! <laughs> Why can't you like jiggle your fingers and then pull it? Why is really? this becoming a, a fetch quest game? Yeah. I'm not digging the, the direction they're taking it now. Gotta overcome obstacles in life. Like Listen, you just need to put your dick in the box. Two. Better open the box. No, let, let her, her. her open I'm sorry, box. this has to be her choice. Exactly. Right. Whoa, does that guy have a dick? Like, Why are you so dick obsessed? I like, know. if you need one, there's plenty oh, of them. <laughs> there's plenty of crazy. <laughs> this guy's not a friend. He does not see your batteries out of the eyebrow. Uh, fuck it. Let's play. No, fuck it. Let's play. <laughs> yeah, it's a circle run forever. She's just trying to find me. Tell us where to go, you're the 
direction master. Um, he was obviously supposed to be there, but like he has to juke that guy because there's like a thing where you can push it in front of the door. Yeah. Oh look, there's just another guy. He's chill though. Pray for revolution. These are all men. Where are all these men in the woman's room? I think they killed all the men. Right, could be. There's that thing in front of the door. Oh wait, never mind, you can't push that. I think you just picked up a fuse, didn't you? Yeah. Me? You, yeah, you have one fuse now. This dude's like slowly walking towards me. Yeah, I'm not sure of that. Uh, <laughs> uh, he likes your tender eyes. This way, this way, here we go. This way, this way, suck my hole. Well, that door's clearly knocked down. Wait, right, was there something right the there? Thing in front of him. That, you picked up fuse. You see one more. Where the fuck did you go from here? Right there. Ah, now he has to open that door. Fuck it. You need three fuses there, right? Right, you just need one more. I don't think they'll find me. <laughs> I sound like a pug that's really excited. Uh. They see me rolling. They hate me. Trying to catch me riding dirty. You catch me riding dirty. You catch me riding dirty. I Why want does them. He get, get, don't flip. These are Chrissy's pajamas. You need to flip them. <laughs> Why do you have Chrissy's pajamas? Because I didn't bring my own. Because you know you've been. You Tony. sack of shit. Fuck you. You, you Fuck all y'all. Piece of shit. Maybe it's back farther? Why don't you bring your own pajamas? <laughs> but you do bring them. Useless. Mm, I feel like I'm going totes the wrong way. The earth is pretty. He doesn't know how to set his own background. Tony, how many alcohols have you had? How many alcohols? I how many know. does how many it take? You had? Can you speak English? None alcohols. I've this place looks like it was on fire. Sarah. Sarah surveys that. Alcohol. Driving the nails. Alcohol. Driving the nails outside, Tony, written in blue. Yep. Yeah, th this is like a new room. And he's gonna drive the nail. Oh, like oh, that guy. He's upside down, Neil. That's some Satanism shit. <laughs> nah, that's actually not. I mean, it is modern day, but before it wasn't. Yeah, but now it is, so. Right. Because, who was it? Wasn't it like Saint... I don't know. I want to say Saint Peter, but I feel like that's not a real one. Saint Peter is a real Saint, Saint Peter is a real one. I I know one of them was crucified upside down. Uh, no! What the fuck? Oh, hi. Oh. Now what? Aren't there stairs Oh, great. Hey, Let's get the gang together. Oh, it's Old mayor's trick! Boom! Door. <laughs> where, where did you come in from? No, oh, that's probably where I have to go, you're right. Because it probably fell, right? And there are stairs right here, conveniently. Oh, no. battery now. Don't fucking do it. 
Good luck. Well, um... Why do you have so many fucking pillows in this house? I can't fucking get up because there's pillows everywhere. <laughs> Deal with it. Bitch mom, yeah. bitch mom, bitch mom, bitch mom. What? Mm-hmm. Do you think we go down here? Yup. I mean, there was an arrow pointing up. This is the way we came from, but... Yeah, but that person fell. You think into, they... the, into there, probably. Downstairs? Yeah, I wouldn't keep going down. Are those batteries? Two of them? Yep. That's the first time I've ever found two. Laundry. laundry. So yeah, this way. Because he went down the laundry chute. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'm gonna go past that. I don't know why I keep checking these. There's been w one anything in any of them, and it wasn't even cool. Well, looks like we get to go past that dude with the big knife. So here we go. Yeah, he's getting kind of soggy looking. Yeah, that once we got the body, it fell down, and we went down to get it. There's bottles of water over there and tea. Or you can grab a glass. That's fine. Right. Why is the water warm? Because beggars can't be there choosers. There is a bottle of water in the fridge. If you want it, Kelsey. Yeah, just take everything. It's a million packs of hot dogs. Gotta eat all these phallic meats. It's Jed's motto. It's a phallic meat all year. Is that your real diet, Jed? Pretty much. Phallic meats, the diet. Pretty good. I feel like I'm going the wrong way now. You feel like what? I feel like I need to go back upstairs. Now that I have that key, I don't know where to use it. You failed it. You're done. That and it's one fridge for four people. You don't need the same thing. You gotta go up the stairs, dude. Well, maybe we can't follow you. And now, what's on the other side? Can you unlock that now? Uh, come use those, Mark! The key opened the lock? That's For the third floor, like it oh. said? Crazy. Alright. Oh. Thank goodness somebody keeps smashing their cameras and leaving perfectly full batteries behind. Yeah, who had all these exactly ident identical? Did they just hand them out to the patients to document all the little <laughs> experiments they were doing on them? <laughs> You're totally gonna have to walk on that ledge. Yeah. Yeah, let's fucking follow the guy who apparently spent a lot of time murdering people and then spreading their blood so in a trail so that you could follow, follow him. him. Well, he didn't have any breadcrumbs, so... Right. When there's no breadcrumbs, use the closest thing to breadcrumbs. Breadcrumbs? Breadcrumbs. Ah! Probably hurts jabbing your stubby finger. I'd yeah. imagine. Badass motherfucker. You're gonna have to fight. Oh! Oh my god. 
that the wall right here? Yep. Ghost, you're a dickhead. You probably just scared them. Sitting there chilling and you fell off the ceiling. Yeah, that scared the shit out of me if I were a ghost. <laughs> Where's your blood that you're supposed to fall off? Oh, in there. There it is. Where's the guy who takes off heads? Whenever he's not in the game for more than 10 minutes, I start to get suspicious. <laughs> I think he's gonna come out of nowhere again. It's story about ch ch time. Ch 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 children g g g g g gather round. Gage, read this one. It's all you. Excerpt from the diary of Shirley Pierce, Mount Massive Mental Hospital patient, 1952 to 1964. How can I not remember where the, where the cuts are coming from? They hurt so deeply, even days later. Dr. Newhouse tells me that it's my fault. I'm subconsciously resisting the hypotherapy, hypnotherapy, but I want so much to get better. I don't know how I could be doing this to myself. Dr. Newhouse says it's another condition of my bedroom-inspired hysteria. Poor Bruce, I make him suffer so. I've tried subtly to ask Mrs. Jackson if she's had similar issues with her husband, but she is loath to talk about it. Her husband, too, has found comfort in a younger woman. I know the doctors only mean well, and with the help of the government men who've joined the staff, I'm in the very best hands possible. I should just take my pills and sleep and hope for more dreams, more pleasant dreams tonight. That's incredibly depressing. Really? I'm sorry, Miss Jackson! <laughs> Miss Jackson, if you're nasty. My name ain't Baby, it's Janet. Miss Jackson, if you're nasty. Bro, reload your battery. Battery's reverted. It's like horrifyingly dark without the camera. Yeah, one of these times I'd love for you to put the battery back in and there's just a face there. No. Yes. Kelsey, no means no. Stop trying to force it on me. If I wanted some of it, I would be like, hey, yo, yo, baby, let me holla. Yo, baby. I don't think that's gonna seduce any, anything. <coughs> yo, baby. Yo, baby. Hey, let me, this, let me holla in hey, that hole. Hey, baby. Fucking Yogi Bear. What this do? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. like a picnic basket. And then All that die. meat and no potatoes. Oh, it's Dick. It's the Dick Twin. Oh. They don't fuck around. Yeah, so they definitely do want to kill <laughs> With that big old daddy dick. No, the one guy is just girthy. <laughs> so what was up with these guys? They have dicks. I see that. They've been following him around, telling him how they want to kill him. Like some Well, okay. I'm dead again. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're walking past. Dick twins don't fucking doors. Oh, that was a good one. You could probably just make a break for it. Because it doesn't look like they're very. It doesn't look like they're very fast. Well, I think the purpose of them is just to kind of haunt you. Because if you just avoid them, they disappear. But if you run towards them, they like stab you. Clearly. They get a little stabby. You know what? You should just take a nap and see if all this just blows over. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I missed that, Joan. Doctor didn't wear clothes. He had on 
Like, I love when you make weird sounds. Now, kiss me. Kiss me like your daddy taught me. It's funny because you don't ever lose this camera. You're going down with it. Oh no. Why not? Wow. Wow, you just got fucked. You had like eight batteries. Well. I like the sad music. It's like you lost Wilson and cast away. Wilson! I think you're gonna have to go down. Gag on it. I got went perfectly in the fucking hole. Yeah, well, Tony, when you got a nice <laughs> one, then you know how to work it. Now all my water is ice. That's all the you bitch more than I do. <laughs> I put it in the freezer and then I forgot about it and I was like, I'll just put it in the fridge. And then I forgot about it until you said something. <sighs> Did you put it in the freezer because you wanted it to get cold so you could drink it? Yeah. <laughs> now I feel really bad. Do you want me to put another one in No, it's fine. No, it's fine. No, I have wine. Now that you have no, I put that in like a day ago. Oh, okay. I thought it was something you just did. No. <laughs> I'm the worst guest. <laughs> no. Bubble gum shrimp company bullshit. <laughs> Is that your claim camcorder? No. Who are these guys? Just mental bees. Mental bees. It's a shake that I don't, I don't know things. We know. Shut up, Jed. Get a job. Oh, yeah, it's definitely just going to be right there in front of me. I don't. You're going to grab it, and then there's going to be a thing. Can you not reach over that to grab it? Like how it was laying by a kitchen. Get ready. Get ready for scares. <laughs> and it's broken now. What was my objective? This is the third floor. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Right? They just like look for ways to fuck you over. They're like, look, you're outside now. Sorry, you gotta go back in. the whole fucking reason you're here in the first place. What a heartbreaking ending would be if the ending was just your camera and it smashed. Fuck do I get up? Pipe? <gasps> or that? I guess. All that made and a broken camera! That's not broken on the screen until it comes up. BT does. Maybe it's the lens that's broken. Oh, true that. True that. You got logic. Mmm. <gasps> I'll burp in your mouth. I'll burp in other holes. Can you burp into my anus? I'll burp into your Tony pussy. Randall. Tony, I'll buss in. I'll, I'll buss. I'll I'm getting tired. I'll burp into your pussy, Tony. Please do.
can't pull me batteries. I got 10 out of 10 batteries. Damn. Shit's about to get dark! <laughs> Is this where I just came from? Yeah, you're, aren't you supposed to go back the way you came, though? Yeah, I don't need to go up now. No, I'm not like, is this where I literally just came? That wasn't too shabby. How do we know he's in the administration hall? Because Morgan Freeman told us. <laughs> you should probably to see with this broken ass camera in the way. Yeah, it's really annoying. Hey, you're friendly, right? Only one way out. Only one way. To die, right? That's the way. That's the way. Turns out you can beat the game right off the bat by just dying. Stop. You already guessed that. What did he say? How do you know you're not a patient? That makes me think that we are not a patient. Now that he said it. Why is there all these things? Because, they know how to organize. right, they're like, listen, this hallway, bookshelves. It's feng shui, Tommy. I wouldn't expect you to understand. Look at that big dude. So, looks like we're about to find the fuck out. I haven't seen him in a hot minute. Oh! I'm bringing back hot minute. That's pretty fetch. <gasps> that will never happen, Greg. Guys, this is the perfect hiding spot. <laughs> I'll never notice. <laughs> Pretend to be That's a fire. That's why I assumed it's four. <laughs> Pretend to be a fire. Wave your arms around and go. <laughs> we got <Yeah>. this. <laughs> You're five. Turn the toast marshmallows on you. Right, we're not. <laughs> You did it, you're a genius. <laughs> Perfect. You made it out scot free, you're the best. <gasps> oh my god. Oh god, go! What the fuck, dicks? I think you broke it. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? <laughs> I think he walked out again. Can you back up and try to get I think he tried to get in on the wrong side, so it glitched out. There we go. God, that was terrifying. Your ass just hanging out. Okay. <laughs> Is that a lady? Does it? Yeah, this looks familiar from very early in the game. Does it? Please. Please. Turns out, what actually happens is you get you get back to the very start of the game and you just keep repeating it. Yes, coming! I'm coming! Don't get all testy with your priest. The door is freaking. Well, it says retreat from the recreation hall, which says it's upstairs. Or through that door into the right. Oh shit, he told you. I like this whole lights thing. Oh. I hope you can play pool right now. Or billiards, as us enter, sophisticated people. Enter know. pool mini game. <laughs> you think he'd be smart and like I don't know, grab a cue stick? Grab that sweet ass cue. Listen, if I have a cue stick or pull stick or whatever you want to call it, how am I supposed to have my camera? Logic. You don't have another hand. You have two hands. Shut up. 
If you find a knife, you could, like, take it to your camera so you can, like... You could stab him as you record it. <laughs> That's what I mean. That's the only way to do it. Beautiful haunting music. You're a beautiful haunting music. That was almost nice and then nonsensical and maybe insulting. <laughs> All rolled into one. Um, the lockers down there? You fucked. Look at the exit. All around the corner and down. Yeah, this guy is gonna need to hide the locker. Aww. Yeah. What a cutie. How's he not starved to death? He doesn't have to know. Give daddy a kiss. Don't you love your daddy? Snookums. <laughs> Creepy. What's this weird dad kick that he's been on? I don't know. He's been on it for a while now. What, you don't love your dad? I'm gonna tell your dad. I don't have a father. Welcome to the club, cunt! <laughs> Whoa. Uh, exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Mm. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. The films are real. Uh, there was no alteration <coughs> of the footage at all, no triggery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, English words are insufficient. More than hope, the human mind in that environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed a proximity to death, to overwhelming madness. We're bootlegging this movie. Only a test subject who had witnessed the horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. Do you think that they contacted something? Nothing is supernatural. Oh. I'm not the only victim here, not by a long shot. I watch a man wait to burn to death, the most painful death imaginable, rather than stay in this place. I've said it before, but fuck this place, I've still got these fingers left. <laughs> God help me, I think I've seen the wall rider. So much blood in the water, I can smell it like putting a penny in your mouth when you were a kid. The whispers are making more sense. I'm looking for static. It's like an itch. Itchy, tasty. I recognize the handwriting. Father Martin killed a man here. Are the lies he's talking about, all the files missing from these boxes, the facts, the records? They look like government agency material, at least 30 years old, probably older. I start thinking MK Ultra, CIA, mind control, the buzzing won't stop. The man sounds like Dr. Strangelove's anemic brother. I love this It's a 25 year old audio recording, an interview with this Dr. Warnicky. Los Alamos means governmental work. Wernicke talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumor psychosomatic reactions, and sufficiently disturbed people. Seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mysticism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine. The morphogenic engine. Morphogenic. Yeah. The engine, the m movie they're projecting, it gets in my head like a song that can't stop humming. A Lincoln C. Rorschach test that looked like swarming insects and infected surgery wounds. The patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's the buzzing right here in my bones. So you're obviously going into the project wall rider was a gateway. 
a gateway to what? I want to hear this actually. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. Right at the part where they were talking about what it was a gateway to. God damn it. It's a gateway drug to a pot. Turns out this entire game is an anti pot message. So deep. That's what he said, and I said, alright. Remember the lockers back there? There's lockers everywhere, damn. Uh. You have to find Vertigate. Only way. Didn't mind me. Hiding in a locker. But Vertigate's dead. Murdergy was supposedly dead when he was here. Yeah, they pretended he was dead. I love how you snatch those files. <clears throat> Give it here. Yeah. Necrotizing fixitis. Watch the ice. I need to adjust. Real hot. It's real warm in here. Wash those hands regularly. Is that a winky smiley? Really? I fucking quit. <laughs> <laughs> Negrotizing facilities? Really? I fucking quit. It's like a real disease. What, flushing bacteria? Yeah. I know that. I'll kill you in like three days. Some intense shit. There's this one guy that the it got in his face and like ate away most of it, but he survived. <clears throat> and that's why you don't put your face on toilet seats for a living. <laughs> for a living? Right. But it's okay if you do it as a hobby. It's okay, it's okay <laughs> if you do it in a three way, actually. Or four way. <laughs> what? Okay. Drama! So it's loud and audible for you. Let me make it juicy for you. Someone just ran down the stairs. Right, but the door's open now. And we're gonna shimmy, shimmy, cocoa puff, take it to me now. Light it up and take a puff, pass it to me now. You guys know that song? No. The classic Nelly. Rest yeah. in peace, Nelly. I heard it. Nelly's still alive. Let me live my fantasy. <laughs> Tony's calling me on face off like you talked about. Do you have to jump to the ledge there? Like the uh, balcony? Mm -hmm. Pop. <coughs> I'm Is that that key in here? Yo. Mm -hmm. uh, Pop, can we get back where we're going? Back to where you came. Or is the door open? Yes. I wish you could do like slides when you run and then duck suddenly. Too pro. This guy's probably not working. Right, he's a journalist on the action, yeah. Well, he's pretty good at balance. Oh, okay. It's that fucking rip head. I thought the exit was up here. It's like boarded up. Go up that door over there to the left. That door's open and there's like something right there. What's open? Were they, like, they were pounding on it? Like they're in there now. In this room? Yeah. It's right there. Is that the dick guy? No. Yep. Yes. Dick Brothers. Where's the other Dick Brother? This door? Yeah, that's where he came in.
Well, he's obviously gonna kill you if you get too close to that. Just do it. YOLO! YOLO! <laughs> well, that dick brother was pretty chill. I mean... When you got a big old daddy day, oh. you're pretty chill in general. Something pretty spooky. <clears throat> Thanks, right, Father. Here we go. No, it's just the final countdown. Or not. No? no? Oh. Just some other guy that looks like he'd be. They just part. framed it. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. We were so wrong. I just want to see the end of this, so I don't want to go to bed. They always love the TV, now this dude's praying to the TV. Oh, look. <sighs> Armpit smell. Just kidding. The static again, a patient known in prayer. Maybe he bought Father Martin's line of bullshit. Maybe he hears what I hear, but more clearly. Maybe it's his way out of this place. The priest called it the Gospel of Sand. So that's like snow, but sand. I See it called that too. Let's play a game of billiards, bro. Let's get done praying. You know, everything in this place looks run down and old for the most part, except they always have them sweet looking computers. Sweet looking what? Computers. Well, this area actually looks pretty nice. No, we already went that way. Because you need your administration building. Pretty fucking nice, yeah. but the patients Fuck live in a yeah. shithole. Well, when you're doing terrible experiments on them. I guess so. How do you know it's terrible? Anyway, so. I mean, yeah, how do you keep fucking normal employees around if your shit's just crumbling? Dear baby Jesus. Dear static baby Jesus. Please bring me a Mercedes Benz. My friends are Porsches. I must make a man. You know that song? No. Probably not. I'm a big fan of uh, the Joplin. Of the state of the fuck you going to do here? Oh yeah! Look who it is! Dick bro! Looking good, bro! Alright, let's do this. Probably wanna reload your camera. Yeah, just in case. My job! You alone shall escape the Tampa. This is your penultimate act of witness. Is that him on the cross? The yeah. promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. And, and here it is. You will watch and record my death, my resurrection. And together we will be free. Why are you looking around? You are the one. see where to go next. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free.
No, I'm general. Well, they spread the fuck out of the sword. They spread us the gold. Apparently the ESRB is, uh, they have a two-dick assault in <laughs> limit. Can't believe Father Martin right? won up to Jesus Christ himself in shitty ways to die. <laughs> and I don't believe I'm going to miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth, now I've got a way out. And a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. I like that this game's just not afraid to say whatever. Ripper was because he wasn't there, was he? Mm -mm. <clears throat> I don't think him and the priest get along. I don't think he gets along with anyone. Especially not heads. Yeah. <laughs> Speak of the devil. Oh, there he is. A long <laughs> ass hallway. Yeah, let's get out on the ledge. Holy shit. Nope, the old loop de loo. Monster. What? Why would you call it? Why would you? Yeah. Well, you probably want to get out of there as fast as possible and not that way. And the music drops, so. Not this way? No, not the other way that you're No, you, you can take the elevator. There you go. To the front door, please! <laughs> This game is like an interactive... Oh, look at that. Almost like I called it. This game loves to torture you. This is like the ultimate haunted house in the form of a video game. Yeah, I'm using real color. God damn it. What is fucking... It's like a science facility. Dude, what the... Yeah. What? Sure? Suddenly. Is that ice? Ice, ice, ice baby. Too. Hey, remember seeing that earlier in the game? Yeah. What? Well, this is strange. <laughs> Fucking M. Night Shyamalan. Walrider <laughs> projects. Under the mountain, because we're on like a mountain. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> Whoever finds my corpse. Trust no one and tell everyone. I am not crazy, I know. I know, only crazy people say that. <laughs> but I am as sane as this world allows with a camera full of evidence. Don't call it gospel, call it a mockery of reason. Let the world know it is Murkoff's fault. Bury these bastards with my mutated, or mutilated dead body. So I've pretty much just been like, well, Don't forget. call it a gospel. I've been here for years. I feel like I've got every single file though, just now. From the personal personnel file records of Dr. Winnicky, Frankenstein or the Modern Prometheus by Mary Shelley, published anonymously in 1818, chapter 23 excerpt. Man, I cried, how ignorant art thou in thy pride of wisdom. Cease, you know not what it is you say. I broke from the house angry and disturbed and retired to meditate on some other mode of action. Okay then. Is that a reference to the head rep dude? He's like the Frankenstein of the of the game. I think so. 
Look at all those head rips. Yeah. I'm just body parts. Of course. This is like literally like each one of these sections feel like a different movie. Like this feels like something like a combination of like the thing. Yeah, it and really then does. like some things feel like it's a reference to like The Shining, and some things. Feel I like, like the, the nice tunnel. change of pace though. Like it's a entirely different I, I, feel. I yeah, hate that I'm getting cock teased with the end though. Like I like I know, it, but right? I hate yeah, it at the same time. So They've done it like what five times now? Right. I feel like this place is going to be relatively safe compared to other places until we run into like someone big and angry that rips heads off. I wonder who that will be. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, well this part, this place is apparently into some dark shit. Unlike the rest of the facility. I know, but as a research facility. Yeah, considering it looks all scientific. Well, that's what your okay. character says that right at the beginning is that these people pose to be like charities and things and do like horrible things supposedly behind the scenes and make money off of it, so. Yeah, they say keep them up to the basement and didn't come back. And this is the basement. Hey, light. And it's a car or something. What's this way? A truck full of dead. Dicks. Yay, dark nope. stuff. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's exit. go back to that door first. You'll need a key or something. Green means go, Tony. He means for the exit. I know. I was just saying that this way is the way I should go first because it has the color of green. Bippity boppity boop. This is the morphogenic engine, a few lines of mathematics and algorithm. Reprogram us, turn us into nightmare fix factories. A few numbers on a dry erase board. Give me a hacksaw in a few hours alone with Dr. Wernicke's corpse. I feel I owe him a death. Wernicke's. Good job. German. The W's. I don't get what they mean by nightmare engine. Oh, well, because you remember the German dude said that there was like an engine that would only be started by people who were like had the worst fear or something. Yeah. What's that one? That's what one? Oh well, never mind. Just keep going. You scared me. Yep. Oh, of course. Oh, no more ah. could, could they be two different projects? I guess early on there was a video of like something that you couldn't see dragging people around. Oh, my God. <laughs> He, that was very satisfying. I want yeah. the next back. I think that, oh, I think he got a note, I think. Or something. What yeah. was that little flashing thing? Oh, yeah. yeah. This is the way you die. Ripped to pieces from the inside. Watching your marrow scatter on a concrete wall. You escaped one help, Chris Walker. God help me, but I somehow hope you didn't find another. Well, that's pretty nice, Pretty I guess. nice, considering this guy's been trying to kill you for Trying life. to rip your head off. <laughs> Yeah, maybe that guy did want to keep it contained since apparently these, the people are what fuel the wall right here. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. That's pretty good. And then you rip off your fucking head. And that does make sense too, because it's, it's just powered by like memories and like nightmares and stuff. Mm. We're just trying to do the right thing, guys.
Where do you go now? I don't know, but all those exits back. are locked. Yeah. I like how it just keeps cock teasing you. Like, oh, there's the delivery exit. Just kidding. Just fucking kidding. There's got to be like an emergency room somewhere. Or this magically open. Buy it. I know. I I know. A gun. I'm supposed to be dead. No, no such luck. I am older than sin, but somehow. The only one left because of Billy. Billy the wall rider. He takes That's care of a picture of Prometheus. Me. He may think I'm his father. Having his liver he certainly loves me. Out by a Idiot. Because he gave fire to man. It haunts of a nano hazard. Microscopic machines. Technology we have had for decades but never mastered. Kirchhoff discovered in my research a workaround. Turning the cells in the human body into nano factories. It's the natural function of cells to produce molecules, but through psychosomatic direction, we engineered the precise molecules necessary. What? Mind over body. It was foolish and wrong to think we could control it. Use madmen to make something so strong. You have to stop him to murder Billy. Turn off his life support, his anesthesia. You have to undo what I've done. No one can get out of this place while he lives. You must kill him. So Billy controls a wall rider? It definitely seems that way. So they somehow, through psychotherapy, made you produce nano machines with your own cells. I think he meant like the like your mind and stuff is like powering the nano machines. I think that's how those people have been like living with like their mouths sewn shut. You know what I mean? Maybe. Let me give you a hand. I like that the wall rider has been like massacring people. So far he's just kind of chased you though. He hasn't even hurt you yet. Hmm. <sighs> Man, Taco Bell is a bad choice. So the wall rider exploded all these people? Maybe. Yeah. Why is it not hurting you, I wonder? That's <laughs> what happens when you eat Pop Rocks with Coke. Let's get rough. Yeah, batteries off the wall too. <sighs> I wonder why it is giving you so many batteries when it's very bright where we're at. Make you feel good. Right for now. There'll be no lights. <laughs> <laughs> oh, alright. You killed me. Yeah, really, how the hell are you supposed to like. Yeah, so Wall Rider does want to Does anyone not want to kill you? I mean, the priest was talking about nailing you to a cross. Unless he was talking about himself. Yeah, he was just talking about you and then he said drive the nails in with my own hand or something. You missed it. You missed, missed it. it. Right, pass? That? The lab? Oh, derp. Let's go right this time, so the lab. So, 
Yeah. I want to read this one. All right, read aloud. Uh, note to all personnel from consultant MM008, Rudolf Wernicke, DBNR. Do not worship the swarm nor allow the delusions of the patients to influence your beliefs. Any sentient being based in this technology will be so far su superior to us that illusions of godliness will be reasonable. We've always looked into chaos and called it God. We now are blessed with sufficient power that such belief could destroy us. Do not be tempted. Remember that you are sorry and just... So I bet they have some stamps or commercial. Hmm. Wow, that's like almost exactly like the thing from Fear that they keep all my own. It's kind of disappointing to see. And Alma is like a ghost child that's controlling another being. Yeah. And you kind of have to kill her. Maybe there's a twist. Twist? This is really what Fear 3 should have been! Sometimes you gotta Superman that hoe. And watch me who hmm, that one's clear. That one's a little murky. I'm going to, I just wanna take a gander. A little peek of Ruski of what's going on with Ruskies. What did that say? Let's see what this file says first. It's annoying that I have to do this. Oh, that's a big one. No one wants to read this. You can pause it and read it. Disabling, disabling fantasy. Game controls. Can you scoot over a little bit or something? I'm just like on fire. <sighs> the way this game controls reminds me of this old first person beat em up type game from uh, original Xbox. It was called Breakdown. It's not a bad thing. <laughs> 
boy, if there's anyone here, they're gonna hear me coming. Oh, um, a coffee mic marked coffee. What does this one say? I bet it says something about the modern Prometheus. Yep. So wait, why does it say that it was by Mary Shelley, published anonymously? Like, she published them without her name first, or what? Yeah, because she didn't want it um, to be judged by the fact she was a female author. Did it work, clearly? She pulled a, she pulled a J.K. Rowling, because she's the first person to ever do that. Well, then, and I think then people thought it was Like for real, they thought it was. Then after the fact, or no, like at the time, like people thought it was Percy Bysshe Shelley. Shelley around to say his name because he was a writer too. <laughs> he <has> writ. <laughs> Something up here. Yeah. Obviously you're supposed to go up there. Yeah, you can slide between those two barrels. Why didn't you say that? Because I thought you saw it. I thought that's what you were trying to do. And then the wall oh. rider was there. Yeah, I thought that's what You just turned the head, I think. Yeah. So you gotta get out of there. And then just go between those two barrels, like side <laughs> here. What if I just tripped on those, uh, what was that called? Pallet? I just tripped on it and died. <laughs> Credits. Bet you that old guy's gonna kill you at the end. What old guy? Yeah. Maybe. Apparently this is the part where you run up for like half an hour and then make the leap of faith. Almost miss it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. They see me filing. They hate him. Please find this hatch the permission to proceed form from patient William Will Pope. Pope of the Murakoff Charitable Psychiatry Program at Mount Massive Hospital in Colorado. The form of standard and all relevant lines have been signed. It appears Billy is unaware of his mother's recent guided cardiac arrest. He has submitted Submitting to the experiment with the understanding unfounded of financial remuneration of his mother and a charitable contribution to her church. Wanneke 
Wernicke, having read the boy's dream reports, believes he has enormous therapeutic potential. Kill him and then what? Any any ideas? And then you escape. Do you yeah, think the whole place just implodes? The place is in lockdown because of him. Oh, somebody got me midair. And it's tossing me to and fro. Ah, uh, tis but a flesh. Question. Kind of could have went inside of you. Get out. I've heard that one before. It's always been my objective. Oh, uh, look how look how fast you walk now. Cause you just got your shit slapped around. <laughs> Is this the way out? Yes. No, I think it's back up that way. Yeah, I mean the delivery exit is really the only way out. Yeah, if he's grabbing the stairs and shit. Yeah. Turns out the dick twins show up, and then there's some gratuitous rape scene. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised, really. Like this game does not give shits. It does what it wants. I think one of the patients or something shows up and helps you out. Not so far. You think the gimp shows up and you just ride on his back? <laughs> <laughs> one could only hope. That would be the best ending ever. And no, uh, fucking knew it. <laughs> I fucking knew it. That's some bullshit. <clears throat> and you ghost. <laughs> I'm going ghost. Hey, Mark. You. Have becomes a host. Jesus God, what is that thing? Oh and now you're the wall rider and you just fuck him up. Credits. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that ending. I, I mean, I, like I said, I didn't see it going any other way. I didn't really like the ending, but it was a good game. Oh, it's a good game. I felt like there were some things in there that were too video game for how thematic the rest of the game was, you know? Like picking up batteries? Yeah. I thought the ending just had so many batteries. 
time. Right, and you never really, I never ran out, like, ever. No. So it didn't really have, like, a real effect. I guess it kind of adds tension, but if, I mean, in added, reality, you don't ever run out. It added a little tension when you got down to one battery, but that only happened, like, but as soon as these guns are over. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! You should stay in case there's a surprise gotcha at the end. You know, I think you became the floating nanobot demon thing and killed everybody. The story was mostly original until towards the end. Like, it's just so like... I don't know, overdone with like the whole Nazi experimentation thing. Yeah. Kind of threw a... Uh, and when we kind of pulled the fear thing where it's like, Alma's real body is really making this little girl ghost. Like, that was like directly from fear. True. Now that your like, story has to be like perfectly original. I like how Vernicky like manipulated you to uh, turn off the life support. Why were you so much more confident than any of those soldiers? Yeah, where did they come from? Well, they sh they showed them earlier, and they showed them all getting slaughtered. Yeah, I mean, yeah, why, why, why are you so much better? Mm. You're also kind of maybe, maybe that was it. You're going crazy from everything else going on. Supposedly, like crazy people have better chance with the machine. So really, maybe the whole thing was just to make you crazy enough that the nano machine can bond with you? I think you just kind of stumbled into that situation, honestly. And you're just like, well, fuck, you're somehow out there. But at so the end, did, do did you... Yeah, for me. you haven't died yet? At the end, uh, Who became it or whatever? It said got something? He's like, got him. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that means like anyone know. I'm pretty God sure. I think it's like God in Christ or something. Yeah, or like I think holy he, yeah, I think Christ it was or an God, holy God. It was just an expletive. Yeah, in German. God in heaven. I think it's God in heaven. So he's just kind of saying. Ghost. <laughs> Y'all almost with the most. Well, that was a thing that happened, so Outlast. Pretty good. It's a game. It's a game. It's on PC right now, and it's going to be on PS4 later. I say like eight hours. And it's going to look... There's no reason for you to buy it, because you've watched the entire thing. <laughs> right, you've watched the entire thing, and you now you don't have to torture yourself by playing it. And uh, then you can see it even better than it will look on PS4, because I bet it looks better on PS or PC than it will on PS4. Anyways, thanks for watching. Click the like button and the subscribe button and write horrible comments about Kelsey. Just really gratuitous, nasty stuff. And me, because I know how much the internet The hates internet me. loves you. Tell Tony he needs to lose weight. Look at that fat fuck.